One time there was this monastery and they were kind of musical. So every morning they'd chant, morning, and all the monks would chant back, morning. In the evening, the head monk, he'd chant out, evening, and everybody else, they'd all chant, evening. And one time this, this new monk, he just tired of it. He didn't like the singing. He thought it was ridiculous. So one time, he got there and they, and they started out and the head monk, he chants out, morning, and all the other monks, morning, except for one monk, he, this one that's a little disgruntled, he chants, evening, and the head monk, he says, someone chanted evening. Now, I heard a joke about Social Security. Uh, you probably won't get it. You know, it's been raining for days now, and Gus, he just looks through the window and gets all depressed. If he gets any worse, I'm going to have to let him in. You know, I stayed up all night to see where the sun went, and then it dawned on me. There was this fellow down south, and he, he owned a store, and just a couple guys I'd be out playing checkers in front all day, and he just, but he had a, a kind of unique thing where he'd quote a Bible verse to people when they came in, and a little boy would come buy some candy, and he'd say, oh, well, honor thy father and thy mother, as he rung him up. He'd always give a little Bible verse, and one day, this man drove in with his horse trailer, and the man said, it's getting kind of cold. I need a blanket for my horse. You got any blankets? He said, sure, I got a blanket. And he went back in the back and he got one. He brought it out and said, that'll be $5. And the man said, this is a purebred racehorse. I can't put a $5 blanket on him. So the man went back in the back and he grabbed another blanket, different color, off the same shelf. And the guys were playing checkers watching this. And he came back out and he said, well, that'll be $50. And the man says, you don't understand, this horse is worth millions. I don't put a $50 blanket on my horse. So he went back and he got another color off the same bunch of blankets and he brought it out and he said, that'll be $575. And the man said, great, and he bought it. And the guys were thinking, well, what's he going to say now? So he rung him up and he said, he was a stranger and I took him in. You know what goes through towns and over rivers and goes over mountains and crosses deserts and never moves? Well, yeah, it's a road. Do you know the technical term for owning too many dogs is roverdose? Knock, knock. Who's there? Surgeon. Surgeon who? Surgeon you shall find. So hit your like and your share, subscribe to this channel, and make some comments to let us know what you're thinking about, and if we can do it any better, or what you're thinking, what you want to have happen here. Anyway, thanks for listening.